What happens after the sun sets? Well, first off, the sunset is the point in time that the trailing point of the sun itself disappears below the horizon. But you probably already knew this, and there's a lot that happens after the sun is fully set. You may have noticed, after the sun sets, it's still pretty bright outside. This time of the day is called twilight, or dusk. But first, let's explain why it's still bright outside. This is because while the sun is set from your perspective, the atmosphere and clouds above you are still illuminated by the sun. So the light is still being reflected from the sky down to your location. During this time, if you were to turn around 180 degrees from where the sun is set, you can see a dark band on the horizon. This is actually the shadow of the Earth casts on its own atmosphere, which is referred to as the Belt of Venus. There are three stages of twilight, civil, nautical, and astronomical. Each stage has their own level of significance. Civil twilight is when the sun is 6 degrees below the horizon, from your perspective. The reason it's called civil twilight is because some governments recognize this stage as technically still daytime. And at this stage, it's still light enough outside where you can see objects visibly. Nautical twilight is the stage where the sun is 6 to 12 degrees below the horizon. It's harder to see during this stage. It got its name because sailors could still see the light where the sun set on the horizon, and used this to find their bearings and navigate the oceans. Astronomical twilight is when the sun is between 12 and 18 degrees below the horizon. This is when it is now dark enough for nighttime astronomy and when surveying the night skies can take place. But the sky can still get darker at this stage. After 18 degrees, it is now nighttime. The sky is no longer in a twilight phase. This is the portion where the sun no longer reflects light off the atmosphere and to your position. This is also the time when nocturnal predators such as owls, bats, and foxes start to hunt. Thanks for the support on my last animated video. I'm currently looking to expand this into a series. If you'd like to support this series, please share, like, comment, and maybe even subscribe. But until next time, I'll see you in the next video.